The movie Parasite won the Best Picture at the Academy Awards and the Oscars in 2020. In the beginning of the film, the father tells his son with a smile on his face. Like this, we make plans and make resolutions, but unfortunately, fail. Why is it difficult to keep our resolutions? The short answer is because we are overly optimistic about our own plans. When we welcome the new year in January, we make New Year's resolutions such as going to the gym or learning a new skill. A recent study from the Statistic Brain Research Institute showed that only 9.2% of 1,273 respondents felt that they have been successful in achieving their New Year's resolution. There is some scientific evidence to why we continue to set resolutions that we more often than not break or can't stick to. Dr. Janet Polovy of the University of Toronto calls this phenomenon the false hope syndrome, wherein we have a tendency to underestimate the difficulty of self-change and therefore set aspirational expectations that aren't realistic. Based on this theory, a way to tackle this phenomenon could be for you to learn not to be overconfident and over-optimistic when evaluating and planning your goals, but rather setting more realistic goals. In the movie Parasite, the father tells his son that the way to never fail a plan is to have no plan in the first place. But in life, we need to make plans and resolutions whether we like it or not. The best way to succeed and keep your resolutions is to set goals that are realistic and are achievable, even if they may be small or trivial, and avoid setting unrealistic and distant goals which is often from our desire and intention to show off to others. Once we succeed in our smaller goals, this often breeds belief and momentum that we can succeed in bigger and greater things. So, let go of your unrealistic goals and expectations and simply be more realistic.